Hello and welcome to Brainy Gardener. Today it is all about how to grow and care for the Tom Thumb Cactus. Tom Thumb Cactus is a small cactus found in the wild throughout Brazil, Argentina, and Uruguay. Grazing and agricultural threats have resulted in reduced populations in its natural habitat. This cactus is prized by landscapers and gardeners for its small size and interesting shape. This cactus grows slowly and can reach a height of about 3 inches. The stem is short. Flowers are almost as tall as the cactus itself, and serve as the head-like feature of this cactus. Around 18 to 20 ribs cover the green stem sporting sharp spines that can easily cause contact injury, so handle with care. Tom Thumb Cactus is a popular plant used in rock gardens, succulent gardens, or as a houseplant. It is tolerant of neglect and can withstand periods of drought. However, it will produce more flowers and grow more vigorously if given regular water during the growing season. Tom Thumb Cactus needs full sun. Only the scorching summer sun should be avoided. It grows best in full sun but can tolerate some light shade if the sun gets particularly harsh. In its natural habitat, it is often found on rocky hillsides or grasslands. When grown indoors, place your cactus near a sunny window. A cactus grown without enough direct sunlight will be unnaturally green and be prone to root rot. It is drought tolerant and can survive long periods without water. The plant will start to grow in March and watering should be gradually increased until late, May when the plant should be fully grown. It will grow best if given a deep watering every two to three weeks during the growing season. Allow the soil to dry out completely between waterings. During the winter months, reduce watering to once a month or less. Tom Thumb Cactus is native to South America and can withstand warm temperatures. Therefore, it can be outdoors year-round in USDA hardiness zones 9B to 11B. If you live outside these zones, Bring your cactus indoors during the winter months to protect it from frost damage. As long as temperatures remain above freezing and your cactus is dry, it will be fine. This cactus prefers low humidity. If the air is too humid, it can lead to root rot. If you live in an area with high humidity, place your cactus in a well-ventilated location and grow it in a pot with drainage holes to allow excess moisture to escape. These cacti don't need much fertilizer to thrive. If you choose to fertilize your cactus, Use a light application of cactus food every two to three months during the growing season. Be sure to follow the directions on the fertilizer package, as too much fertilizer can damage your cactus. Tom Thumb Cactus can be propagated by seeds or cuttings. To propagate by seeds, sow the seeds in a pot filled with a cactus mix or fine sand. Cover the pot with plastic wrap to create a mini greenhouse and place it in a warm, sunny location. Keep the soil moist but not wet and wait for the seeds to germinate which can take two to four weeks. Once the seedlings are big enough to handle, transplant them into individual pots filled with a cactus mix. To propagate by cuttings, take a cutting from a healthy part of the plant using a sharp knife or garden shears. Allow the cutting to callus over for several days before planting it in a pot filled with a cactus mix. Place the pot in a warm, sunny location and keep the soil moist but not wet. Once the cutting has rooted, it can be transplanted into an individual pot filled with the cactus mix. Repotting Tom Thumb Cactus is seldom needed as these are small cacti that remain small throughout their lifetime. These are slow grower plants and require a lot of time to outgrow their pots. If the plant has been in the same pot for over five years, it's time for a fresh batch of potting mix. When potting or repotting, use a pot with drainage holes to allow excess water to escape. Choose a pot that is slightly larger than the root ball of your plant. To repot, carefully remove your cactus from its current pot and loosen any roots that are bound up. Plant it in the new pot and backfill with the cactus mix. Tom Thumb Cactus is not toxic to humans or animals. However, it has sharp spines that require careful handling. Keep out of the way of curious pets. It is susceptible to mealybugs. Mealybugs are small, wingless insects that feed on plant sap. If you see mealybugs on your cactus, treat them with insecticidal soap or neem oil. 